So I spent just a little bit more time playing around with the U2Go PC tablet. And um, my overall impressions are that, well, it's not perfect. Like it's, it's definitely not perfect. I mean, look, okay, compared to, you know, what I would consider like more like the uh, Cadillac of touchscreen devices. Okay, so here's the rotation feature on my iPhone. Here's the rotation feature on the to-go PC. Yeah, it's not quite as slick. It's functional, yes, but the polish isn't quite there. They've also got their included easy bits quick menu thing here, which uh, seems like the kind of thing that would benefit a lot from an SSD as well as a slightly more powerful GPU. I'm gonna keep watching this. Because, uh, oh, whoops, yeah, this is a home network. Okay, do that, but go away. So when I try and browse this, it's not like, uh, it doesn't have that snappiness to the GUI that something like an iOS does, where when you're navigating around things and you're looking at stuff, you know, it just has that, that feel to it, like it's all you know, meant to work that way. You see that legginess? I think I think a lot of that is uh, accessing the hard drive right now. I mean, the overall choppiness is uh, is probably GPU related. Um, you know what? The keyboard's actually not bad. So you know, here, why don't we go to? Uh, so if I want to access the keyboard, I just do that, and then I can. Okay, that was my fault. I missed, but okay. So we'll go to Google. Oh, I missed again. No, that was totally my fault. I know I'm making the, the touch screen look inaccurate right now, but it's not. Okay, so Google, then I close the keyboard. It goes off to the side. As soon as I do this, I can either touch there or I can touch here to get access to my keyboard again. You know, so I could look for dogs with hats, for example. And then I could easily do my internet browsing on my little tablet. So I can scroll around now. Zooming doesn't, oh, oh, it does work. Oh, look at that. Okay, I didn't even figure out it worked before. So you see zooming isn't really perfect. It's quite uh, choppy compared to, once again, we'll go back to the iPhone as an example of uh, what zooming should look like. So I'm going from one application to another one. Here, here's a good one, exoticcats.com. I'm even on 3G right now, but you know, here, here's what zooming should look like. You know, here's what zooming looks like on this tablet that I accidentally minimized the window. So we want to see dogs with hats. We got a kind of bit of a delay there. Okay. So it's not perfect. Yeah. The GPU needs to be a little bit more powerful, blah, blah, blah. But watch this. This is a flash video. This is me putting it in full screen mode, and this is me watching a flash video. Do that on your iPhone or your iPad. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to check out Linus Tech Tips. Or, not to check it out, you're checking it out right now, but don't forget to subscribe to Linus Tech Tips.